When you have a sequence you are happy with in Premiere Pro and want to render it, first select it in your project panel and click File, Export, Media. This will bring up the Export Settings dialog box where you can adjust the video codec, quality and other parameters. The video codec H.264 is great for uploading online. Next, we want to click Q. This will launch Adobe Media Encoder and add your render to the queue. We can define the file's name and output path by clicking here. Once you're happy, click the green button. This will start the rendering of your sequence. Rendering can take anywhere from a few seconds to a few hours depending on the complexity of your sequence. Once your render has finished, you're now ready to upload your video to Behance. Go to Behance and log in with your Adobe ID. And once you're in, click on the Add Work tab. You can either jump straight into uploading videos and images here, or use the Upload Files tab. I'm going to start by uploading a still image from my remix. You can upload videos direct to Behance in the same way. You can also embed your remix from websites like Vimeo or YouTube. To do this, go to your video and get the embed code. Copy it, navigate back to Behance and paste your copied embed code here. And you'll see your video is ready to play. Now click continue and you'll be prompted to add a cover image. Click upload image and select the file you wish to use for your cover. You can then crop it to the size you want. When you're happy, click crop. Then add a project title. I'm going to call this off and click continue. You can then categorize it under various creative fields like art direction, graphic design and motion graphics. Add project tags like 3D, motion graphics, geometry, whatever you feel is right. Give your project a brief description and then hit publish. And you're all set. You can now share your work with your peers and get feedback from your friends and industry professionals.